Hey everyone, it's Brianna and in today's video I have a super duper exciting, exciting video. Oh my gosh, I ordered these last Friday and it's now Thursday, so they took six days to come. I'm so excited. So in this video I'm going to be doing a first impressions and I'm going to be wearing this shade which is Coco K all day long. It's currently 2.21 p.m. And I'm going to be eating with it on. I'm going to be doing a bunch of stuff and testing it out. See how well this works. I'm also including swatches and everything like that. Also keep in mind for the swatches, I am very light skinned and my lips are pretty pigmented. So the swatches might look a little bit darker than what you would have expected them to be because I do have pretty fair skin. So this is the box it comes with. I just taped everything so you couldn't see my address. And the sides look like this. When you open it, it looks like this. It says kyliecosmetics.com, Kylie. And inside it has all the lip kits that you ordered. And then it comes with this cute little note. And then inside come the lipsticks. And I only ordered five because, not gonna lie, they are pretty expensive. They're $29 each and I didn't have enough for six. The only one that I don't have is True Brown K. And I honestly didn't really think that I'd ever use it anyways. I'm sorry that I don't have the swatch for you guys. But honestly, I just wasn't really a fan of it. And these are the packaging. Oh my gosh, let me show you guys. Everything about the packaging of this is beautiful. I love the famous like lips with it dripping. All of them look exactly like that, but with the actual color on the lips. I'm going to open it for you guys and show you everything. Like this is so exciting, you guys. So as you can see, it comes with this little piece of cardboard separating it. And on one side is the lip liner and the other side is the liquid lipstick. The packaging of these is unreal, unreal. Here is what the packaging looks like. They are absolutely stunning. Here is the liquid lipstick and the applicator of them is just divine. It makes it so easy to apply. And then here is the lip liner. It's just really nice and creamy, but it's also stiff, so it's not creamy that it's going to just like smudge everywhere. It's, it's creamy, but it's stiff. It's the perfect amount. So here are all the liquid lipsticks next to each other. This one is Coco K, Candy K, Posey K, Dolce K, and Mary Jo K. They are all made out of glass, and even the lids feels like either really, really extremely good plastic or maybe even glass. I'm not sure. Like, I don't even know. The packaging is just unreal. I can't talk enough about the packaging. I'm so impressed. Here are all the lip liners. Coco, Candy, Posey, Dolce, and Mary Jo. I love the packaging of these as well. I love how they have all of the colors on the top so you can see which color you're using. Now let's get into the liquid lipstick itself. So she was saying that she reformulated the lipsticks to make them thinner and not as thick. I didn't have the previous lipsticks, so I've only had these, so I can't really compare them. But the formula of these is amazing. I have Coco K on right now, and it doesn't even feel like I'm wearing a liquid lipstick. I have a ton of the ColourPop liquid lipsticks, and it just feels like your lips are just like shrinking in. The formula of all the nude ones is really, really great. I don't know if it was the one that I got specifically, but the red one is kind of streaky when you apply it. You have to apply a few coats to get the actual intense all red, all one color color. I don't know if it's just the one I got, but it is a little bit streaky because it is so thin and lightweight. The formula is amazing though, and it smells, it smells like cotton candy that's what it smells like that could bug some people just hold your breath when you're applying it <laughs> it's so thin i can't explain it it's like you're not wearing anything but your lips feel protected i don't know how to explain it now let's get on to the lip swatches i'm really impressed with how easy they are to apply because i'm not the best at applying lipstick as you might be able to tell but they were surprisingly really easy and i love that they come with a lip liner so you can outline your lips and then fill it in and not worry about like, you know, having like a bumpy application. Everything is just so easy to do and overall I'm really, really impressed. I'll let you guys know later on how I feel about them. But let's just hop into the lip swatches. <laughs> Thank you. 
lip swatch portion and I just removed all of the ones and I'm going to put Coco K back on. And since I was removing the lip swatches, what I'm going to do is take this concealer brush. It's by Real Techniques. It's the 102 Triangular Concealer Brush. It's amazing for like getting that sharp line. So I'm just going to be using it around my lips. And this is the Anastasia um, Concealer. So now that we're done with the swatches, I'm going to be coming back to you guys in a couple hours and checking in each couple hours and telling you how it works. So, yeah! Hey guys, it's Brianna Joy, recording live from Chipotle. I'm going to be interviewing Jalen, who is my fiancé. I'm going to get his thoughts on the lipstick. You know those interviewers that just take so long to get to the interview? So Jalen, what do you not like about me wearing lipsticks? It's lipstick. It's all gooey and ugh, slimy and it gets all over my lips. And on my white t-shirt, I mean... So you hate that it transfers to your lips? Oh, I can't stand it. What do you not like about liquid lipsticks? Like the ones that dry completely matte? It makes you look like you're like an old woman. Like, they're so it's so dry and it's got all the creases in there and stuff. It just, you know. What about when I kiss you with the dry lipstick? Feels like I'm kissing cardboard. <laughs> now we are going to do a kiss test and we're gonna, we're gonna see what he thinks about this lipstick that I'm wearing. So Jalen, what did you think about that? I saw sparks fly. <laughs> Your lips actually feel normal. I mean, mm -hmm. is that the new lipstick you just got or what? Mm -hmm. I, I like that one better, to be honest. Yeah. Your lips don't look all like crackly and stuff, you know. It's man approved. You can wear this lipstick on Valentine's Day. You can wear it on your first date. Jalen approves it. Now we're going to go eat Chipotle. And we're about to eat this. Oh, yeah. So we're at Chipotle right now. It's currently... 5 p.m. and I've had the lipstick on for how long? Three hours. We're about to down this, so this is my lips before. Okay guys, here is after I ate Chipotle. I'm looking in the mirror right now and it hasn't like flaked or anything. It kind of started fading in certain places, but it's not like flaky and gross. Hey guys, so I'm back. It is now 9.30 p.m. So I've had this on for a good seven hours. I have not reapplied it. Sorry about the lighting. I don't have studio lighting or anything, so I normally film during the day and it's nighttime. So I'm just using my ratchet light. I'm just going to talk to you guys about my final thoughts on the lip kit and all that kind of good stuff. As you can see, my entire bottom lip has faded off. My top lip is still going pretty strong. I mean, it is starting to fade. What I like about this formula is that it fades off. I've been eating with it, kissing, you know, all that kind of stuff. Of course, it's lipstick. It's going to wear off. But I'm really impressed that it doesn't, like, look ugly when it wears off. I mean, come on. One lip is different than the other, but it's fine. I'm going to reapply it before I finish talking because I kind of look like a crazy person. So overall, I would rate the Kylie Jenner Lip Kit, I'm going to say 10 out of 10. It's the best liquid lipstick I've ever tried, maybe 9 out of 10. When she comes out with other products, I am buying all of them because these are just insane. Highly, highly, highly recommend. So they are $29 plus $8 for shipping, but it is worth every penny. I hope you guys liked this video and if it was, it was helpful. If you get the chance to get your hands on one of these, I would highly recommend it. It's so worth it, you guys. I'm so impressed. Kylie, job well done. So anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Let me know what ones you want to buy. And maybe next time when she comes out with more products, I'll do a giveaway. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Of calling when you've had a few, cause I always